Hi, it's Jesse from Peach Manifesto, and today I am reviewing Chantelle Joy's Chevron's plate. There are three plates in the set. I only have two right now. I will probably get the other one. I really like these. Um, they're very graphic, and I, don't know, I really like them. There's matching patterns to the chevrons. I'll insert a picture of where I've kind of used them both where there's the pattern and the chevron separately. And I'm gonna go ahead and do something a little kind of spring and light. I know there's already a review um, or like a tutorial of Chantel's plates um, that she did with Debbie. Um, but I thought I would do something a little different and kind of my own take on it. Um, I know Chantel, she's really great. We're friends, we've taken classes together and I have taken her classes. So um, she's awesome. You should get her plates. I think they're wonderful. And drawing chevrons freehand while I have done it totally sucks. Um, Stamping them is a lot easier. Some of my things didn't turn out as perfect as I would like them, mainly because it's kind of hard to stamp where I have my camera set up. I need to find a new setup. But anyway, the chevrons here, I'm kind of doing like a floral and then a graphic and then a floral. You'll see. Anyway, I decided to do this one kind of almost like an Easter egg or something like that. Um, and it's kind of nice that the image is so long, especially with the big bling. You can kind of get like two shots out of it. And this is the one that particular didn't turn out as perfect as I would like it. But I think that's just me. If I did this on a client, I'm sure that they would be totally fine with it. They wouldn't even really notice. But you know how you're your own worst critic. That's me, for sure. <laughs> anyway, um, uh, the colors that I'm using, in case you're wondering, are Time is Money and Peppy Fuchsia, Peppy La Fuchsia from Sally Hansen, and then uh, number 051, which I think is like Champagne Bubbly or something by Clear Delay Stamper. And I think they look really stunning together. I love kind of like that kind of aqua green pink and gold I think it's pretty classic um, combination and I think it goes really well together I decided to do because I just love the way the gold looks almost like foiled I decided to do just the pinky nail all in these like little chevron and uh, I think it looks stunning I will totally be doing this on myself at some point um and I like that you can kind of mix it in with the one beside it and like layer it together. I decided not to just because I thought it looked really classy the way it is. And this one is really neat. This is a rose pattern. And when it's finished, I feel like it kind of looks like um, almost like a teacup type of look. And I do end up outlining it. And I love the way that it came together outlined. I almost wish I would have done the other chevron with an outline as well. But I was like nervous I was going to mess it up. I should have just went for it, but I didn't. But in the future, I probably would. So this is what uh, the roses look once you get the kind of pattern over top of them. Again, it's not super perfect, but it's darn close and um yeah I, once you see with the chevron uh, I did the chevron lines you can really see the pattern come together and this is where I say it like totally reminds me of like a teacup pattern or like a fancy china set or something it looks really cute anyway I just think that this plate is super uh, unique and versatile. You can do so many things with it. You can be like really graphic. You can be really floral. I don't know, just like all the different sizes of chevrons, you can create so many patterns and styles. I am just so glad that they came out with this plate. I think that I'm definitely going to get a lot of use out of it. So this is it all together and top coated. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe and we will see you all later. Bye bye.